For your microeconomics final exam, this is why perfect competition and monopolistic competition do not achieve profit in the long run. And before we get started here, if you wanna see where you stand for your actual exam, go check out my free practice exam in my bio. It's got 25 of the most common types of problems I see professors test their students on. Now with that being said, we're gonna start with perfect competition here and then apply that into monopolistic competition because monocomp inherits some of the traits of perfect competition. This perfectly competitive firm right here is generating profit. And the reason is because as at this MR equals MC point. When I go down, I can see that it's above the ATC. So we're generating like this rectangle of profit right here. I don't wanna cover everything up because I'm gonna reuse these lines. But what's gonna happen in this perfectly competitive market in the short run is that new firms are going to enter because they're gonna see from outside the market that the firms in it are generating profit. And due to the zero barriers of entry or exit with perfect competition, they're gonna say, sure, I want some of that profit too and enter the market. The same thing goes for if a perfectly competitive firm is generating a loss in the short run. They're gonna operate at the MC equals MR point. And when we go up, we can see that, that hits the ATC right here. So this rectangle right here is loss. This means that this firm is in the short run because they're not at zero profit. And in turn, what's gonna happen here is that due to the free entry and exit in this perfectly competitive market, firms are going to start leaving the market, which will eventually bump back up marginal revenue to this zero profit point. This is what a perfectly competitive firm's cost curves should look like if they're in the long run. The MR, MC, and ATC curves all intersect at one point, meaning that P equals ATC, and all the income that the firm's generating from consumers and the price that they're charging them is going right towards average total cost. 